Hey my friends, welcome back to Falcon RC, the home of the scale foamy jets. And we're going to keep working on the MiG-21. Uh, at the moment, pretty much we're gonna, I think, hmm, let me decide, I think we're gonna work on the cockpit. Yeah, and that way I can get, start figuring out where my electronics are really gonna be. So what I'm gonna be doing right now, I'm gonna cut this about, well, I, well, uh, actually I'm, I'm, I may replace, nah, I'm just gonna cut up about a quarter of an inch inside over here cut it a little bit down or maybe all the way across you know and put me a piece of plywood in here so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and that way this will be the place where I'm gonna be sitting my electronics of course I'm gonna try to keep it away from going into the intake itself you know because we don't want to block the air so let me go ahead and do that guys okay my friends so I did the plywood already in place and I was gonna put a bunch of holes on it you know to to make it a little bit lighter, but there, there was really no need to make it any lighter. It's already pretty light and it actually made my nose stronger. And it's gonna keep my air cleaner in there, you know. And this is the cockpit, you know, I cut it off of it and I went ahead and put a, a two coats of epoxy on it, just to give it a more of a string on it and put it on my vacuum mold box pretty much, you know. And I made me a clear cockpit, as you can see right here. That plastic, plastic guys works very good. <laughs> uh, I actually made two of them. You know, this is the very first time, like I said before, I, I did this. You know, I made that box a while ago, but this is the first time I actually use it. And this first one, I didn't like it that much because uh, I, I didn't, I, I didn't put the extra foam over here. Let's see, see that extra layer of foam on the bottom, quarter of an inch. I added that one after I did the first one because it didn't come down good enough, nice enough. So I did this one, and now, you know, it's in there very nice. And I'm just gonna, you know, I, I, of course I have to cut like a little plate or something to support it on the edges. But it turned out very nice. And the reason for it is not that I want to have a clear carpet so much, you know, it's actually room-wise. Cause with this one, I can carve it out, you know, but it will start getting too weak. So I think I like it a heck of a lot better like that. I have much more room in there to work with for my electronics. Um, I'm thinking, you know, I was looking at this, you know, I still have some plastic left and it's pretty much about the room I have over here, you see on this part. So I'm gonna cut this part out of foam and I'm actually gonna mold it too because it's, it's just, you know, you see right here, plenty of room. I don't know how you can see it because it's clear, but it fits in there. And I'm just gonna mold this over here so it'll be hollow and I can just run my wires through it. It'll be a lot easier to work with. But well, anyway, my friends, uh, they, we're gonna cut this video now because I'm pretty much ready for mending fly. I'm just gonna run my extension wires over here, just temporarily, I'm just gonna run extensions on this one, along the vertical stabilizer, all the way in here. And we're gonna do the mending fly. So the next video is actually gonna be the mending fly, my friends. So wish me luck and we're gonna get this puppy on the air pretty soon. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and wear it though, you know, see how much it weighs before the mending fly. So okay my friends, uh, thank you for watching. Subscribe, see you next fly.